Elsewhere tonight, the South Dakota DCI is now investigating an officer-involved shooting at the 83rd Sturgis Motorcycle Rally. Sturgis Police Department saying that the incident happened at around 10 o'clock Mountain Time this morning at the intersection of Junction Avenue and Dixon Drive near the Big D gas station. Officials say that one person was injured in that shooting and no officers were hurt. Roads were closed off for a period of time due to the large police presence in the southeastern edge of Sturgis. Now, South Dakota Attorney General Marty Jackley says tonight that this is an isolated incident and does not expect it to have any impact on the rest of the motorcycle rally. There were several officers involved. I can't get into the details at this time. I've had an opportunity to be at the scene, I've had an opportunity to see some of the video, talk to the officers. We want to make sure we do our due diligence to talk to all the witnesses, gather all the evidence, have it forensically tested, uh, and then we'll be issuing more information soon. The South Dakota DCI continues to process that crime scene, uh, working with local, state, and federal officials. Again, once the investigation is complete, the DCI will issue a case report and a shooting summation to be reviewed by the state's attorney general. Now, the fifth day of the Sturgis rally continues to see citations and arrests. In the last 24 hours, the South Dakota Department of Public Safety says there have been 19 DUI citations, 37 misdemeanor drug arrests, 33 felony drug arrests, and more than 200 total citations. When it comes to crashes at the rally, there have been six that were non-injury and six with people suffering injuries as well.